for producing one of the liveliest atmospheres in the English game. We're in South London at Selhurst Park. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Crystal Palace versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, really, it had to be further away from the keeper. And here's the Palace eleven. Jeffrey Schloop starts alongside Eberechi Eze in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And here's the Wolves lineup. Adama Traore starts with Gonzalo Gedge in the wide positions. And the striker is a man who can be a real handful, Raul Jimenez. What a crucial intervention inside the box. Well, for the visitors, an awful lot they need to do better in terms of scoring goals. Look at that record, Stuart. Not a pretty sight. Well, their forward play hasn't been good away from home. The passing's too slow, the movement's not dynamic enough, and nobody's dribbling past defenders. Can they improve that today? I'm not sure they can. The delivery towards the back post. Well, it still could be dangerous. Gets! Chance, maybe. Well, a time for composure on the ball. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Traore. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. We're going to see the first yellow card of the game. The referee not standing on ceremony. Well, he's under pressure now. It's a long time to be on a booking. Not the worst free kick in the world, but the goalkeeper equal to it. Ezzy. Oh, great vision. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. And that'll be offside. Perfect challenge. Oh, he's through here. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. And there's the delivery. Able to deal with the threat. Plenty of support here. Are you... Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? And block for now. Real chance. And there it is. The breakthrough. That will do nicely. Well, we can take another look now. It's wonderful interplay between the two of them to start the move. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. And they get the ball moving again. Can Palace come up with an answer here? Ezzy. Are you? And Crystal Palace moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Ezzy. Gives it a go. Terrific block. And a goal! An end-to-end -end game. And they weren't behind for long. Well, here it is again. 
First to the ball, clever header and a good finish. He's done really well there. So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Well, spot on with that challenge. For Dense. Wolves might be able to cash in from here. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So, back underway. Intriguing contest, this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Well, time just challenged magnificently. the replay and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back and his movement's so clever once he gets onto it there's only one thought in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal and level again here this has been quite the roller coaster ride opportunity to deliver the cross bodies forward and the break looks on He's in here. It's still alive. And that's the hat-trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, here it is again. And I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with. But where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. Well, the action underway once more, and no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Jimenez. Oh, big opportunity. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end, but you still have to be in the right place, keep your composure and finish it off, and that's exactly what he did. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Very timely interception. Well, as you can see, Wolves are struggling to control possession, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Couldn't quite hang on. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Ezzy. And a strong tackle. Pedro Neto. Opportunity in the wide area. And possibilities here. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. Now the delivery, and he succeeds in scraping it off the line.
And that will be all for the first half. It's Wolves who hold the advantage at the halfway stage. What So back underway here into the second half. Well, that's how to beat your opponent, but no damage done. That's the main thing. Could be a chance to break here. Useful looking ball. And there it is! Another goal! And surely there's no way back from this now. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And the movement is so good that they end up with a 2v1 against the goalkeeper, who was completely exposed. Great play, but poor defending. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. And a good-looking ball. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Not showing good vision. Zaha. How to play it goes. He was under a bit of pressure. High pressing at its best. Jimenez. Jimenez. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. And opting for the short free kick. And the right place to cut out the pass. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. It should be! Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the situation. And taken short. Well, let's see about the cross. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Adama. Traore. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Clean challenge. Tremendous ball played through. Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Well, we're into the final half hour. Ezzy. Might really be able to trouble them here. But the danger averted for now. Adama, Mateus Nunes, and a goal it is, but offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Substitution for Crystal Palace, coming off the pitch, number 15, Jeffrey Schluck, coming onto the pitch, number 19, Will Hughes. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? Will Hughes. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Mark Guehi. Hudson Edouard. And very deftly cut out. Hughes. Nicely saved.
It's a short corner. It's still alive. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Just made sure nothing came of that. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, that is how to play advantage. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And still trying to get the shot off. What an important piece of defending. Traore defended well. Odson Edouard. And Zaha has it. Well, nicely cut out. Into the advanced position. He's in with a chance. And still danger here. Oh, he saved it. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. He has teammates around him. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And a short corner, let's see. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Taken short. Well, he's given us away. Oh, breezing past him. Jimenez. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Odson Edouard. A real opening now. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. Dense. An unforced error, you've got to say. Odson Edouard. A danger here as he runs at them. Well, goodness me, into the goalkeeper's grateful grasp. Really good challenge. Now, who can he play it to? A fine reading of the situation. Now can they counter clinically? Oh, in with a chance! It's got to be! And choosing finesse, he might be wishing he hadn't. Well, it's good vision, but not the skill to match, I'm afraid. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Ezzy. Getting forward. Wilfried Zaha. Traore. And he's made headway. And a decent save. Full credit. And played short. He takes aim. 
And blocked for now. Constantly thwarted. So full time, it is done and dusted here, and three points for Wolverhampton.